Hi, I'm Kripa Venkatachalam and I will be demonstrating the Synopsys Designware IP prototyping kits designed to provide immediate productivity for hardware engineers and software developers. The IP prototyping kits are part of the IP Accelerated Initiative which provides solutions for early software development, easier IP integration and faster IP prototyping. To get your team going on day one, the IP prototyping kit comes with everything you need for software and hardware development. These kits work out of the box and can be set up in a matter of few minutes. Here is the Synopsys IP prototyping kit for USB 3.0 device connected to a Linux PC running the USB 3.0 device drivers. Included in this kit and set up here are a HAPDX system, USB 3.0 Phi daughter card and USB 3.0 device drivers in this SD card. The HAPS DX system comes plugged in with an SD card which includes USB 3.0 controller IP and associated SOC integration logic. The USB 3.0 Phi daughter card allows you to connect the hardware prototype to real world devices. When you set up the system on your end, you would also load the device drivers onto your Linux PC. Now the IP prototyping kit is ready to be connected to the Linux PC using a PCIe cable. Together, they enable you to start designing and reconfiguring the IP in minutes. The system is compatible with most software development tools, so software engineers can start driver and firmware development in their preferred environment. To see the USB 3.0 mass storage device in action, I will now plug in the USB 3.0 cable onto a Windows 8 PC. You can now observe the PC recognizing the mass storage device. We will now copy a video onto the device and play it from the device. The media file is stored in the Linux PC. It makes its way through the PCIe cable, USB 3.0 controller on the HAP system, USB 3.0 Phi daughter card, and finally via the USB 3.0 link to the Windows 8 PC before being displayed on the monitor. As you can see, this works fine out of the box. However, everyone would like to modify the IP for their own application. So, we have provided a fast iteration flow of tools. This flow uses Synopsys Core Consultant tool with a simple GUI interface to change the configuration, verify and output the new design. We also provide all the other logic as well as the tickle scripts for compiling the design in Protocompiler DX, which is also included. Once the design has been modified and reloaded on the board, you may want to see what is happening on the hardware side. To understand key internal signals and status registers, the IP prototyping kit comes pre-instrumented to capture relevant signals using deep trace debug capabilities. Deep trace debug gives engineers the ability to view several seconds of waveform to speed up debug iterations. This is done by taking advantage of the 8 GB DRAM that is available on the HAPS DX system. The captured RTL waveforms can be viewed in popular hardware debuggers such as Synopsys Verdi or most other waveform viewing tools. Now you have seen how to create a hardware prototype and this now provides a target for software developers to start their driver and firmware debug. Software developers can also use the standard development tools to debug in a familiar software environment. Now you've seen how Synopsys IP Designware Prototyping Kit provides immediate productivity for hardware engineers and software developers. Thank you for watching.